And we have Jonathan and Tutu from South Africa in one. Beyondi Masasi in three. We have Geronimo da Silva from Brazil in five. Martinez Valles in seven. And this is the Brazilian athlete in Geronimo da Silva, 23 years of age. And the gold medalist in that relay set the stadium alight. He has performed well with the Brazilian relay team, including a win in that para Pan American Games in Toronto. But individually in the 100 metres, finished just outside the top 10 at the World Championships. So at this point, it's Savon Pineda who will be the man to beat 1089. And Jabrailov, who came out of that heat from Azerbaijan 1127. And it's all brick from Germany with 1140. The uh, crowd just realizing that they have a, a local hero on the track. That's Biondi Masasa on screen from Suriname. Small team from that country, 25 years of age. Masasi 12th in the long jump here. Competed in the 100 metres in London, finished 14th in the group, finished 13th in Beijing before that. Great to have him here. Had uh, a knee injury for the big part of this year in 2016, and that really stopped him from training for about six months. So it's a big effort for him to make the starting line here. And then Tutu from South Africa has a personal best under 11 seconds. Hasn't run near that this season, but is the reigning bronze medalist from the London Paralympic Games. So, great show of respect there between Geronimo de Silva and Martinez Valles of Mexico. As they're just getting organized down there. When actually not near scheduled time, we're about two and a half minutes before that. So the starters being corralled over there. And to my reckoning, bar for some shot put action, will be the last events in the stadium for this session with some victory ceremonies to come. We also have some further 100 meter heats in the T42 category to follow. As Leo go Geronimo da Silva says, Come on, you can do better than that. So now the official introductions Jonathan Natutu from South Africa, 30 years of age. Competing in the 100 and the 200 here, reigning bronze medalist from London. He's finished fifth in Beijing. And also silver medalist in the 200 at the World Championships. Here is Biondi Masasi from Suriname. Great uh, job to be here after being sidelined with injury. Here is Diogo Geronimo da Silva. 23 years of age, gold medalist in the relay. And Jesus Martinez Valles from Mexico in lane number seven. So a field of four. So the first goes through automatically, and then it's the next fastest. Tutu Masasi, Geronimo da Silva, and Martinez Valles. This is heat three, men's 100 meters T12 classification. And the crowd is hushed.
Ready. Away. No, we're not. Oh, no. Is it the Brazilian? I think it might be. Geronimo da Silva, a rush of blood. And he knows. He knows. It's just... Conf yes. Oh, it was clear. So it's... Unfortunately, disqualification for Diogo Geronimo da Silva. The official will walk over and confirm that with the red and black board. Unfortunately, he has to walk off the track. It doesn't matter if you come all the way from Uzbekistan or if you're a local, it still hurts. So now we're down to three. This really does now open the door for Jonathan Natutu. So ready again. Set and away, and Tutu on the inside began very quickly out wide. Martinez Velez is trying hard, and also Masasi is running well in the centre. It's all in Tutu, though. Time will be interesting, so we can compare it. 11-11. 11-11. So he will go through automatically anyway. It'll be the second fastest of the heats out of the three, but it is the 30-year-old South African who looked comfortable using that inside lane but also be competing in the 200 meters here that time has been rounded down to 11 10 and it's the bronze medalist from london has started his campaign here in the 100 meters in fine style and you get the impression there might be just a little bit of petrol left as well yeah and tutu did very well actually he's won medals in the last four global championships Broke away very, very nicely. He missed the 100 metres final in Doha last year. The World Championships had won silver in the 200 metres. I was very comfortable, really. Helped, I think, by the disqualification of Geronimo da Silva, the 4x100 metres relay gold medalist. Away on the blocks very, very strongly. Martinez Valles and Masasi pretty much for, what, 40 left in the battle for second place. No trouble for the man from Cape Town at all. It's a good, solid time. Arguably, still has a little left. A season's best of 11.11. All time, 10.99. Now, from a Brazilian point of view, whoops, Geronimo. In 2 2. Good rhythm. Automatically through to the decider. Faster than Ulbricht in the previous heat. And it'll be Thomas Ulbricht who will be the next fastest narrowly ahead of Chen Ming Yu from China so the final will be Savon Pineda in 2 to Gibraltar and Ulbricht and confirming in heat number three it was in 2 to 11 10 from Martinez Valdez 11 14